gates go back and they are off and racing. We'll give them a chance to settle down into some sort of formation. Up there's Boom Boom. Enchanted Will wants to get on with things. And on the inside is Lady Soraya. Directly behind that is United We Stand. Boom Boom has got the pink cap and only two lanes off them. Enchanted Will down the center. Then comes Ariel's Jet. Further back to Crimson Forest. Then comes Angel of My Heart with Villa Samaya. They five lanes off the leader. Wild Willows won from last. And the work of life is being patiently ridden by Yeni and seven lengths off the leader. So they go up to the last 1,000 meters. They've just gone past the 1,000 meter disc and in front is Lady Soraya. In second, Enchanted Royal with Ariel's Jet to improve the position. United we stand, two lengths off them. Villa Samaya's got the redhead getting a bit closer. Enchanted Royal lost the position. Boom Boom is on the inside of that. Then comes Angel of My Heart, Crimson Forest, the work of life and Wild Willows to the inside and only five lengths off them. The race develops and Villa Samaya now moves up to Ariel's jet. On the inside is Lady Soraya. United we stand. Further back is Angel of My Heart, but Villa Samaya has now come at Ariel's jet. United we stand on the inside. Red sleeves and white cap. It's still these three horses who've gone four lanes clear of the work of life. It's Ariel's jet who got to the lead. United we stand trying hard. The work of life is running on, but all too late. And Ariel's jet has been given a peach of a ride by Daniel and good win. United we stand second, the work of life, Villa Samaya, and then came Angel of My Heart. All right, so Ariel's Jet, the daughter of Diesel Jet, out of the National Emblem Mayor Emblem Song, bred by Mr. and Mrs. E.R. Grace and Mr. D.D. Savadier. Well done to Erico Verdanese. They on the boards to open up jackpot two. United we stand, number two, decent run in second. The work of life doing its best work at the finish in third. And fourth goes to Villa Samaya, that's number four. Ariel's Jet is the winner of race number five. Raymond Danielson, three winners in two days and 24 hours. Well done to Erica Verdanese, who is the winning trainer. Well done to Mr. and Mrs. Grace and Mr. Savadier, the winning owner-breeder combination. And the uh, daughter of Diesel Jet has won. Stepped up from run one to run two. Well done, Ray. Looked like they never left you alone that entire race. No, look, um, she's quite a headstrong horse. Um, so big congratulations to the team, um, Mr. Verdanese and his team. She used to be actually a tearaway. So she used to fly, jump and be very strong at home. And they got her to settle down. And I watched the first run, she, her, her form line was quite strong. There's the second horse came in one and the winner that they came in one again. So she always had a shot in this race. Um, obviously, all respect to other horses, I didn't think it was a strong race. Um, but it was a tricky race for us because she's headstrong and she needs one to follow. And there was absolutely no pace. So, so I had to do it myself. And I just held it together, let her prick her ears, um, let her get lost a little bit just so she can relax a bit. And once I pressed it, it was race over. Headstrong and needs one to follow. Who does that sound like? <laughs> <laughs> um, just quickly, uh, more to come from this filly? Oh, definitely. I mean, she's still got a lot, a lot of strength to do. And once she learns to relax a little bit more, she can go further. So definitely a lot more to come. Confidence up now? It's always been up. I mean, yesterday I haven't had a winner for a month and a half. And I rode with confidence. So it just shows you. But if you get the chances, you'll always bring them home. So big thanks to the yard, obviously, and all the owners. Um, to Gigi at home as well. This one's for him. And uh, to my sponsors, winning form. Still not seen a tear. Well done. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> well done to Raymond Danielson, the winning jockey. Here's Erico Verdanese, the winning trainer. I'm going to ask Erico about his runner to come. Um, Nico made an interesting observation. Diesel jets down the vile straight. Just run them all there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice observation. It's easy then, you know. But... Um, well done, well done to to Bev, to to Eric. You know he's been there solid with this horse, and uh, I'm so glad. You know he's let me let me alone with her. She's a big filly, you know. Uh, she's not, she's nice, and you know Raymond. I don't know what he says. You know, it's not a strong field. I, just, I want him to show me an easy field, a weak field. You know, when they come home, I, I find every every race is difficult and hard because you know when you start looking at them, all the other horses start looking different and they start looking and you know you start saying well geez have you done the right thing in that 
But but this filly has been very promising, you know, all the time. So I really expect a lot more from her. Yes, we have had a few issues with her, but I think when we can settle with her, and uh, there, there's quite a bit more to come, hopefully, for her, you know. How much progress did she make from her first and second start? I mean, it's evident here today, but yeah. to your mind, were you happy with what you saw? Did she run nicely enough on debut for you to be confident second time out and to work from here? Yes, uh, I, I was very happy with her with her debut, you know, and then the work from the, you know, when you see horses, they, they change so quickly once they've had a race, you know, beneath them. Uh, it was all there, you know, it was just coming on so nicely and... Uh, I would have really been a bit concerned if, if it did go a bit pear shaped for us here today, you know. So I'm, I'm very happy with that, yeah. Diesel Shutter? You know, he's at the Maidens, but he's, he's as well, you know, he's, he's going to be a nice horse as well, you know. This, this Diesel Jet, shame that he, he's producing a few, you know. Not that there's a, there's a lot out there, but, you know, um, he's a nice horse. You'll see him, and I, I hope he runs a decent race after his Maiden, yeah. Well then, Erico, we got your hands full here because there are checks left, right, and centre coming your way. More checks. Yep, for a five thousand rand Betway winning trainer. So uh, that's straight into the pocket. Well done, Erico. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Betway. Lovely. Excellent. Yeah. And then we've got the Racehorse Owners Association prize coming from Jomo. Seven and a half thousand rand. I think uh, the non-member needs a needs a bit of a, a rattle we're going to yes I, I think Eric said that if I win this he's going to give it to me so thank you Eric oh there we go you've made, you've made a lot of money today but you can't take the groom's prize because the groom's here well done I don't know we said we're going to share <laughs> well done very good yeah. thank you guys well done thank to Erica. let's get the winning groom in here as well well done to Erica Veronese well done sir well down with support my bosses because the last time that was us he disappointed I don't know what she was around he says Dom is young go there but I don't know now. you see how long have you worked for Mr. Verdanese? Yeah, I love it. Me, me, I like it. Well, here's your check, 1,500 Rand from World Sports Betting. And that's the end of the checks, I'm afraid. If we uh, look for long enough, I'm sure we'll find more. Well done. Thank you, Was Well done. Thank you. Um, so there we go. That's a wrap. It's Ariel Jet, the winner of race number five. Nice win as well. She stepped up big time from the first to the second start, and uh, she might end up winning a few.